Robin Forrest Walker is following those talks from Almaty. Well, it was made very clear to the media, at least this morning, by the European Union officials speaking to us that what they wanted from the Iranians today, the P5 plus 1, the permanent members of the Security Council in Germany, was for the Iranians to respond specifically to those measures that you've just outlined there. Um, and that's what they were hoping for. Well, a little while later, we, we heard from one of the chief negotiators of the Iranian side who came and said, we have a proposal of our own. They didn't go into it in too much detail. But what we understand is that it, it wasn't the kind of response that P5 plus one were looking for. And they ended up saying that they were puzzled by what the Iranians had said. Well, I'm joined by Ali Vaez, who is with the International Crisis Group and an Iran uh, analyst. Uh, Ali, what's going on? Well, it seems like two sides are really talking past each other. Um, the Iranians are talking about uh, what the first step, uh, what the end game would be. The P5 plus one is talking about what the first step should be. The Iranians are talking about broad principles that should govern uh, this uh, diplomatic process. Uh, the P5 plus one is talking about practicalities of reaching a confidence building measure. So a huge gulf remains in, uh, between the two sides' expectations.